check the roast. Wow. Yeah, I put a bit of uh, primer on it. Right. See? Yeah. yeah. Just takes take the, look the look off. off. <laughs> well, we wanted to look rough and ready. So yeah. what were you doing during the week then? You painted Painted's. all... I matched these two. Uh, nice yeah. Color. We wanted to lose the 2009 look on the car. which so got rid of the fucking Mugen lip. Yeah. The Mugen lip is gone. Jamie. Hi. Jamie gave us the uh, Civic Dive R lip for the front. We lost the Mugen lip and the, and the grill. We left it silver because it looks hilarious. But uh, yeah, we tried to make this thing look like a picture that we would find on the internet of some random guy's Civic in Japan. So Barry is gone hiding. But Barry gave us a loan of his T37s again for the front. And then we left the P1s on the back. Now we're going to add some stickers. See, this green adds two horsepower per piece. Two, four, six, a. 10, 10, and uh, got some stickers as well. These will all add horsepower. We're going to stick them on now. Massive shout out to Stevie, Stevie Rice from Solar Signs. Thank you for sending these down to me super fast. Like, I literally just threw so this at him. They're the back, are they? Yeah, I just Big launched ones. this whole thing at him. Goes, Will you do these for me? I need them tomorrow. Is it good, mate? And he was like, Yep. Yeah. And he sent them down to me next day. Nice oh. guy. Yeah, they're fucking great. So what, guys? If you're looking at this, yeah, we don't, we don't actually have any of this stuff. We just uh, <laughs> wish we did. Oh, we know we've this. No racing gear. And this is a bride. And this. With the only project new we have on the car is paint and pretends. No, we have the pads. No, we don't. No, yeah, right, so we're gonna put all this on the car and make it look cool. even cooler. <laughs> yeah, two horsepower added. Oh yeah. Yeah, second, second, it's the one with, it says little on the door. Instant two horsepower. Yeah, right. So, yeah. We're losing two horsepower here with this, so. Uh. Uh. This is going to be so refreshing after uh, the march. Yeah, the, the march was intense and there was about fucking a million people here. Fuck's yeah. sake. Heels made of bollocks at the eye. the heat going on dash yeah. Neil, what's win max? I haven't a clue. <laughs> I just like the look of it. It's uh, we're gonna win max. Yeah. Okay. Right. Goodbye, genuine dog VTEC stickers. We don't care. For anyone that's gonna give out, they'll have to come off anyway for this to be repaired, so away. And, uh, <laughs> she doesn't have the dock anymore now, but it still has VTEC. Ah, oh, dead. Oh. Now we've lost two horsepower, but we're going to gain four horsepower either side with the new stickers. Oh man. If they want to send us free stuff. Yeah, they're trying to break into the Irish market at the moment. There? Your gap is the same as this is gap. You I get me? Put it there, no, man. I mean, I mean, I mean this, this on against the moldings. You get me? They're up there. Yeah. Just there's a couple of bubbles in this. Ah, fuck it. That's great. Yeah, that's cool. We always leave it to the last minute. How amazing. Every everything. Time. Well, I think everybody leaves everything to the last minute. That's it. Jobs we can stand around like we are. It'll be extra fast now tomorrow. Yeah. Now we're up to 130 <laughs> horsepower. Take a back out and you hey, yeah. as good as you need. Yay! All right, the Civic's still here. Still looks cool. The stickers, um, yeah, I don't know. It's too early. We're all here today, all of us, everyone. Jack's here. Yeah, he's came to give us support. Oh. This is Barry's uh, Civic that he doesn't talk about. 
or ever drive or care about. Yes, ten, years. ten years. First time I ever met you, boy. You're in this Civic and different color. Different color. I have a photo over here with Dermot Dunn. Flick. Was it your first car? First proper car, though. Right. Barry's first proper car. He still has it. He restored it and then he ignored it once he restored it. Yes. Right, well, Philly brought his coupe and he still didn't finish it. It's actually a work in progress at the track. <laughs> it's incredible. We found in the shade. It's like a small or something. It's got dirt on it. We're gonna go for the first lap. These tires are like ice. Let's see what happens. Is she VTEC? That is 1600 SIR engine, is it? Now it's Neil's impression. <laughs> exciting this footage looks to you but we're having a lot of fun I know it doesn't look as great as drifting on camera but I'm sure you can sense the excitement somehow
sham. Just yourself. How are you getting on? Lots of pandas. Success. She's done. Great. Solid day. She had a great time. The car survived, loved yeah. every second. We had a great Each time. sticker that gave us the brake horsepower that we needed made us faster. That was a good birthday. Yeah, yeah. Great birthday gift to myself. What's happening, guys? Um, yeah, so just before this video wraps up, I just wanted to, to say, uh, Happy Christmas to everybody and Happy New Year. I just decided to take the Christmas holidays off, just take a break from making videos and doing stuff with social media and stuff. It's nice to unplug from the internet every once in a while. I just wanted to give a massive thank you to everybody that purchased stickers before the holidays. Hopefully all those stickers arrive over the next couple of weeks. I know with COVID and all this stuff, uh, postage is slow, but uh, I seriously appreciate how quickly everything sold out in the shop. I know it's difficult times and some people, you know, are strapped for money and strapped for, you know, spare funds. So I seriously appreciate people that had the money to buy stuff from the store and support the shop. So thank you so much to everyone that made a purchase. It was nice to send that stuff out all around the world. Speaking of stickers, um, some of our friends have sent us some incredible stuff over the last while. Uh, this is a uh, Cola Corolla, uh, fellow Irish Japanese car enthusiast, and uh, I'll put his Instagram here. But he makes some really cool little drawings of uh, Japanese cars and Japanese car flavor mashed up on unassuming chassis. So really cool uh, page if you're not following him. Japan Revive has been painstakingly drawing up old stickers and reproducing them. So other people can enjoy them, I guess. I know if you have the genuine stickers, you know, you want to keep them and you probably think it's a bit sacrilegious to be reprinting this stuff, but I think it's a great idea because there's so many cool brands that if you're into this stuff, people have interest in and these stickers are long lost unless you manage to get one over the years. And I think it's really cool that you can get this stuff again and he reproduces it so you can put it on your period correct build or whatever. If you're really into the Japanese car culture and you love all the old stickers from the golden era, uh, yeah, Japan Revive reprints some of the coolest stickers ever. So I'll put a link to his shop here as well. So eight, six squid, send me some Tsuchiya heads. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, I've been pounding through the Japan footage and uh, so far it seems like we have 10 hours of footage that I'm having a hard time compressing into something smaller so I don't know what to do there. I definitely would appreciate some suggestions. I was thinking of doing maybe like 10 45 minute episodes but uh, is that just too much Japan footage? Like the people care as much as, as we do. I'm not really sure but uh, so far there's there's a lot of footage and there's a lot of stories. Like we went there to do absolutely everything we could and we managed to succeed about 90% of that stuff so I mean I don't really want to cut it out of any of the videos because we just went there and did probably way too much stuff to really digest so I don't know so far there's about 10 hours and I'm trying to like pack it down and break it up into stories and stuff 
it's not like the last episode or the last story about Japan where we just went to do a couple of things. Like we were there for like 20 days, so uh, just a lot of stuff. So I'm trying to figure out what to do with that at the moment, but uh, it's all coming together really good. So I'm uh, pretty hyped on it, along with a lot of photos to match the content as well. It's a bit of a strange time, you know, coming into 2021, but uh, yeah, the videos are still a year behind, so I've got a year's worth of content to get out there, and there's a lot of stuff there, and uh, doing this stuff has kept me pretty sane, so I really appreciate everyone that's been just, you know, tagging along. I know you're probably a bit stressed about how far behind things are, or you know, how far the 8.6 is, and you want to see content, but it is coming. I'm trying to keep everything chronological, so it is going to appear over the next year. The videos will go back to being in weekly once the Japan thing is knocked out, because like I said, we've got a lot of content to get through. I wish I had more time. Time is the enemy, but uh, we're getting there. Yes, yeah, 2020 was a challenging year for everybody, but let's hope 2021 is a bit more positive. I'd like to hope to finish my car maybe this year also. So, yeah, thanks guys. And as always, you know, it's great to have you guys along for this ride, and it's been an epic journey so far. I cut my hair off like two weeks ago for this funny video we made for my friend's uh, local punk band so I'm gonna just attach this to the end of this video just for shits and giggles it's a bit of entertainment for you guys and yeah thanks again for watching guys I'll see you in two weeks take care goodbye <laughs>